All right, one thing that happened this week that I just had to laugh. Some teenage boys. Always teenage boys. It's always the teenage boys. At least that's the rule on this show. Mm -hmm. Who's shooting out car windows? Who do you think? Mm -hmm. Some teenage boys put... (laughs) Right. (laughs) Allegedly. Where's the allegedly alarm? Allegedly. (laughs) Thank you. (laughs) Some teenage boys put bubbles or detergent or something in the Mm -hmm. Eagle Rock Fountain by Snake River Landing. Yeah, kind of like if you took the the Friends theme, but the Friends were all made out of Tide. (laughs) (laughs) <laughs> I just had to, okay. <laughs> yeah. And part of me is like, yeah, stick it to the man. And the other part of me is, why, El Wapo? Why you got to be like that? Well, I do kind of wonder if it t- damages it at all. Like, does it really have any actual lasting or, effect? Or does it, I don't know, clean it? I mean, one would kind of think, right? Was it the city of Idaho Falls? I mean, I don't know. You know what? It'd be funny if it was the city of Idaho Falls. <laughs> right. But the prank was that they acted like someone else did it. And I guess it happened last October, too. And somebody said, well, it looked a little blue. Was it a Skyline homecoming prank? Okay. Because they beat Idaho Falls High School. In the Emotion Bowl this year? Mm-hmm. What else? <laughs> but we don't talk to the city of Idaho Falls, and they don't talk to us. This is mm-hmm. not. This show is not representative of the opinion of the city of Idaho Falls, just in case there was any question about the IF in our name. But maybe they should. We talk about Idaho Falls mm-hmm. in an AF fashion, but mm-hmm. that's about it. We're not yeah. IF, we're IFAF. Just don't get those two conflated. <laughs> right. The point I wanted to bring up is, this is a common prank with fountains. Oh, Yeah. I don't know if anybody remembers, this happened, you know, the fountain at Toffus Park? Uh-huh. This happened all the time. Right. Not, not all the time, Heck, but they even do a joke a about it on Bob's Burgers. Do they really? They do. Okay. Yeah. Which fountain? Uh, so, think. Tina and Linda go to stay at a hotel as part of, like, a class thing that Tina's doing, and um, Tammy keeps trying to get her to put shampoo in the fountain. Okay. Or at least I think it's Tammy. I don't remember. It's been a hot minute since <laughs> I've seen it. Now, I think they should do the same prank, but just a little closer to when it freezes, so hopefully we get some frozen oh. bubbles. <laughs> oh. See, now, that'd don't, be fun. Don't give them any ideas, Carl. Well, I'm just saying, now that if it happens... I mean, now if that happens, I'm suspect number one. So <laughs> yeah, right. you'll see this mug. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I actually once knew a guy who ended up using his mugshot as a, as his profile picture. Really? It was a really good picture of him. Do you remember ridiculously <laughs> handsome mugshot guy or whatever? Yes. That sort of, uh, I think he had a couple tattoos, but he just had this sort of darker skin, but these just mm-hmm. blazing blue eyes. He mm-hmm. was just gorgeous. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Well, do you know what he was con- like? I don't, know. For? I don't know. I don't know. No either. idea. You know what? It's easier to talk about him if we don't. Right. Because if he did something really egregious, I don't even want to say that he's beautiful. But he, but he became a meme. He, he, he did. Re- so every, yeah. if, if we're guilty of it, everybody's guilty of right. it. Right. That's true. That's this is true. not subjective. Yeah. This is objective beauty he had. Yeah. That's fair. Yeah. You know what? That's fair. And also with a face like that, you don't need to commit crimes. What are you thinking? Yeah, exactly. You he, have so much more opportunity. I hope he got a <laughs> modeling gig out of this. I mean, probably. Probably. <laughs>